Okay, so uh, we uh, uh, brought uh, the kit here in the pavilion to see um, how it's going to be uh, put together. What we normally do is we uh, drill holes on the top and then make the uh, wires pass through that with the uh, light um, at the bottom. So the, the, the wires are going to go from the top onto the cap inside the uh, bottle. We sealed the bottom uh, with clear epoxy. So this does not uh, sacrifice the lumens or the, the luminosity of the light. As you can see, we already have the circuit board inside the casing and we have the switch as well. And then we routed the wires on top. The white and the black wires uh, go to the terminals or the positive and negative terminals of the solar panel. And right now, since we have uh, sunlight, you can see that the light at the bottom is actually indicating that it's charging, okay? And um, the uh, red and white wires now go to the uh, LED light. Now let's try to check what's gonna happen if we try to turn it on. This is the LED light, this is the switch. So you can actually just pull it here, but for uh, the purpose of demonstration, I'll just push it from the inside, see that the light is already turned on. So uh, right now what we're going to do now is we're going to insert um, the waterproof uh, light in the shaft onto the water bottle and see how it's going to look like. So Harold, could you please turn it on? Okay, so that's how it's going to look like uh, at pretty much at night. So right now it's uh, still uh, morning, so it doesn't really have an effect or much of an effect to the surroundings. But once you put it in a dark room at night, it's going to be uh, really bright. Like I said before, it's gonna, it, it can light up. 10 to uh, 15 square meters of uh, room. Yep, right. So that's how it's going to look like. Mm -hmm. 